Okay, hi everyone. So today I will be doing a quick little video. This is a Muji haul. I just went to Muji and picked up a bunch of stuff and thought I would share it with you guys. So let's get right into it. First thing I got from Muji was this right here. This is a desk organizer and uh, it was on sale for 30% off. So I decided it was a good idea to get it, to pick it up. Um, it's very nice. It has one, two, three sections. I was thinking I could store a lot of my post-it notes and everything in here, so yeah, that's what I got. Next thing's pretty boring. I just got these, um, the angle's pretty bad, but I got these cotton sheets. This was also on sale, and these are the peelable cotton sheets. Um, you can basically rip them in half and use it to soak your toner in it into three, see, three sections and you can just make yourself a DIY mask. So I thought that was really cool, so I purchased that. I also found this thing right here. This is a transparent sticky note pad, which I thought was really cool. Um, I've had transparent sticky notes before, but I've just never tried ones from Muji, and I thought these were really cool. This is really great for um, using for the planners, or I don't know, just for anything, really. So let's open this up. They have such interesting things. So as you can see, this is a clear sort of vellum sticky note, which I think is amazing. And I think this would look really chic in my minimalist planner. Moving along, I also purchased this right here. This is the grid paper sticky note. I thought I, uh, this was really nice and really chic. And I really like the size as well because the size is very similar to um, a pocket planner size. So if I put this in my pocket planner, it'll take up the entire page, which I think would look really nice as well if I wanted to switch up um, some of the uh, existing pocket planner dashboards or pocket planner inserts that I already own. So that was really cool. So I purchased that. Next thing I got these um, two things. Um, these are pockets, adhesive pockets. And it's really interesting because the size of it allows me to put it in a A5 agenda. So let me just show you guys really quickly. So I was thinking to use this in two places. The first place would be in my A5 ring bound agenda and the second place would be in my uh, bullet journal, my Lu Lustrum <laughs> A5 bullet journal. This is really cool because it has several pockets. It has a big pocket back here, which you can fit kind of bigger notes. So I can put a full on sticky note in here and then it has smaller pockets here that, that is fine for credit cards or gift cards. So I thought that was really cool. And you can also put photos in here, which I think is really nice um, as well. So I picked this up. I'm really excited about this. So this would fit perfectly inside any old A5 agenda. So for example, if I wanted to put this in this back cover that is kind of made out of a uh, harder cardstock, I could. And I can just stick this into my planner and it doesn't bulk it up too much, as you can see. You can barely see. It bulks it up a little bit, but not, not, not too bad. So you can still close the journal with your elastic, as you can see. But what's really nice about that is um, if you're traveling with your traveler's notebook or your A5, um, in my case, my A5 bullet journal, I can carry some additional things in here like stickers, uh, postcards, memos, a bunch of things. So I thought this was really cool to put in here and it would also be nice in the discount agendas as well. So if it was in a discount agenda, so say I was gonna use this in a discount agenda, I can just find any old page and I actually have um, my dashboard right here that is laminated. If I put this, let me see. If I put this over here in my lam laminated uh, dashboard, which this is my dashboard right here, if I put it inside on the laminated side, then I get even more pockets to play with uh, in my agenda, even though I already have other pockets available, it just gives me even more room to play. So I'm really excited about that. And I'm really happy that I found this um, at the Muji store. Moving along, I found these two really cool picture books. And basically these are just blank notebooks. As you can see, it has 
blank pages. It's all white. And the paper is really, really nice. So it comes like this, and the sizing is really small, and I thought these would make perfect anniversary gifts or birthday gifts for people. And I would just print out um, little Polaroid pictures or, or pictures on a sticker paper, and I can just create a little storybook or flip through book for my friends and family. So I thought this was really cool. So I picked up two of these and these were only $5 each. So right there. Last thing I got is a new pen. Oh, actually two things I got. They put it in the same thing. Um, this thing over here, this is individual sheets of eye, I don't even know what it's called, eye patches. And I thought this was really cool. They also had, um, face mask that you can soak in your own essence and everything so I thought this was really cool because I can use some of my existing skincare and these cotton um, mask sheets to create little eye patches for myself or if I was feeling creative I could use um, natural products um, to create my own eye mask so I thought that, that was really cool so I picked this up as well um, and you can just put it under your eyes or on your laugh lines um, as well really really cool really interesting product Finally, this pen I picked up, it's just a regular ballpoint pen. It's 0.7 mm. And I tried this out in the store and it writes really, really well. I really liked the way it doesn't skip and um, it's like a really comfortable grip as well. It has this little jelly bit over here. And yeah, overall it's very minimalistic and chic. So I think I would be using this quite a bit. For example, it's just a regular ballpoint pen and it writes really nicely. That's that, that's my Muji haul. Uh, quick little video, also I wanted to show off my nice new manicure as well, so I thought this was a perfect video to film for you guys. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you liked it, please give me a thumbs up and I'll see you guys in the next one, bye.